All right, so I don't usually post a lot of tutorial stuff here on TikTok, but this is something I get asked all the time about. So I'm going to help you out and show you exactly how to get faster on the guitar. I do think everyone has the ability to get fast. It's really more about who has the patience to get themselves there. So the most important tool that you're going to use when you're practicing for speed specifically is the metronome. The metronome allows you to keep track of your progress and know exactly how fast you're playing each day because it is all about small baby steps of increasing speed and without the metronome it's very hard almost impossible to notice that day-to-day -day difference. So you can practice virtually anything with a metronome especially when trying to increase the speed. For today's video we're going to stick to a very basic chromatic exercise just to start off with but you can easily apply this to scales or sequences or even lines from solos that you're trying to learn. So here's what I always encourage my students to do is start off with a metronome nice and slow. You have to be able to play slow before you can play fast. So I have my metronome set to 60 BPM so we're going to try to play quarter notes to that 60 BPM click. If you're not able to lock in with that click at that tempo, you're definitely not going to be able to do it when it's a lot faster. And then again, whether you're practicing this chromatic exercise or a scale sequence or any line, what I highly encourage you to try is to practice the same line through the different rhythmic subdivisions. So what I mean is we're going to take that chromatic line and we're going to play it as quarter notes as we just did. And then you're going to try to play the same line to the same BPM in eighth notes, so two notes per beat. Trying to lock in with that click as tight as possible, which is kind of an ongoing challenge. Then we can move up to triplets. which can be very challenging when you're playing four notes per string, but three notes per click. And then next we're going to go to 16th notes, four notes per beat. So how you use this to get super fast and be able to shred around the fretboard is you have to be doing this to your threshold. And what I mean by that is when you're practicing with the metronome, try to find that point where it's starting to fall apart, your hands are stressing up and you can't quite do it. When you're practicing, you're trying to push that threshold a little faster week after week. So if today, let's say 120 BPM is kind of where it starts to fall apart, within the next week or two, you're trying to get more comfortable at 120 and then hopefully you can push that to 125 or 130 to that threshold where you're starting to maybe fall apart but what you're doing is you're pushing your hands out of a comfort zone and forcing them to play faster while staying synchronized, play clean, play on time, hit all the boxes that way. So it's really not a difficult practice idea to do, but it, again, it's really about who has the patience to sit there every single day with a metronome and just see these small baby step increases of speed. And then after a while, you will notice that your speed is much faster than you could do before. So try it out, hopefully that helps. And for more lessons like this, you can check out my Patreon page where I post weekly lessons and videos. Thanks guys.